Hi, I'm Neil Doherty with North Country Whitetails, and I want to talk to you a little bit about shooting your situation. And by that, I mean practicing the way that you intend to hunt. Now, when it comes to rifle shooting, you know, the preseason, we're out there on the shooting range and we're locking down in a lead sled and we're seeing what kind of groups our guns can shoot. But then when it transitions into the woods, are we still able to shoot the same way? Now, guys like Alan and myself are starting to hunt a lot more out of shooting houses. And that poses a lot of problems to the shooter because it's actually very difficult to get a good rest. It's a lot harder to shoot out of a shooting house than it is a tree stand, believe it or not. Now the challenges within shooting out a shooting house is when you shoulder the gun and you're trying to bear down on that deer, you have no way to lock your shoulders or your rear core. So at 100 yards, no problem. You're gonna knock the deer over, not an issue. Start to stretch it out to a 200 yard shot where you're great on the range, now all of a sudden the crosshairs have a lot more wobble than you remember. So you're always striving to try to brace your core and in most shooting houses, there's no way to do that. During the preseason, get out in your shooting houses and spend some time to try to engineer either a rear brace for your shoulders or spend time practicing to try to tighten up your core and look for techniques of bracing with elbows or other things to help tighten it up. It certainly made the difference for Alan. He was able to make a great shot.